Okay, so take it out the head bolt. Okay, so take it out the head bolt. It's a uh, other special uh, thing in a uh, N20 BMW engine. Uh, you need a three type of socket. So I just uh, will show you right now. So you need uh, the negative uh, torque bit. This is uh, E12. There is somewhere. There. You there? It's called E12. You see the E12. You need a torque bit, uh, torque uh, 55, and uh, you need a other torque head as a torque uh, 60. So here is a cylinder head uh, bolts uh, location. One of them is outside here on the driver's side of the engine where is the starter located. One of them here. One of them down over there on deep. You see that? There. One of them here on the front. One of them here on the other side on the front. All right, wait, wait. All right, like there. And one of them over there. This is a E12 torque bit. I just show you to take it out. So it's not biggie. I I did I did before. I lose it. I lose it before. I will post it to the to the torque specification. But it's, a, it's easy. So I did before. So one of them. Yeah. One of them is here. Let's take it out. That is. This one. I will show you after because I have a, a four different type of the, the bolts. And one of them here inside, where there's a timing chain, uh, was located. Here. There you go. There's a small one. One of them here. One of them here. And one of them here. Okay? Good. So coming coming to the we go to the other bolts. So to the other bolts. Other bolts is have two type of head bolts have one here, other one here, one here, this one here. This one required a T55, the T55 and the other ones, the rest of them, the rest of them, there, 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 it's a T6 uh, torque 60 so you can you can see that separately separately I will show you what's the difference between the two bolts so actually so actually it's have uh, the head bolts oops okay actually on a head bolts have on the four corner here where is a camp shaft is uh, located so under the camp shaft one of them here, here on the other side, here on the other side, here on the other one. Okay? So, I will show you. It's a T55, torque 55. Let's put it here. Put it here. Put it here. And put it here. That's it. This four bolt, this four bolt is T55. And you just, uh, as a magnet, just untake it up. And also,
also have under the head bolts washers so this this type of bolts this type of bolts have on a four corner to the head this is the same same high the same high but the head the head is T55 and it's a little ones I show you almost to show you why okay so the the rest of the bolts here have uh, two four six so the rest is have other six bolts it's a torque 60 so the T60 the T60 here so this one is here I just show you I just show you that one is also have a special so that one this one have six of them six of them that's the T60 so you see between the two bolts between the two bolts what is the different is see the marks and the heads and the heads little ones so the little ones just came to the four corner the rest of them is have six of them. It's in the middle. Okay, let me show you something. Always uh, uh, jumping back and forth in a time, but uh, this is how I can show you guys everything a little bit well. So here is we just lucky because we find the the other cylinder head on the, on one of the junkyard. It was on shelf, so no not uh, we take it out if someone else take it out so when you want to remove the bolts here you need to remove the vanuses so when is the timing on it you cannot remove the head otherwise the head bolt here one of them is have on down there down there and you this is a this is this one is a limiter to the Vavtronic system. The Vavtronic system you need to you need to set up for an, or a neutral or all the way to the other one and you need to remove this uh, mechanical limiter you know the Vavtronic system is cannot adjust it for for uh, more down than this pin. So this is a 11 millimeter socket so you just remove that when you move that one and when you did, when you did, just took the magnet and take it out. This is a limiter. It's uh, nothing big. It's not really tight. And it's under there, under there, there have a head bolt also. That is a 55 Torx. Um, then the other side, other side also over there. And the rest of them is not biggie. So you need to you need to move that uh, this shaft you can move it you we can you can move it with the Allen wrench uh, right there let's put it on there I show you so you can move it with a four millimeter four millimeter Allen we just put it in on this there we go and just move it and then turn it you see over there the wheels and that shaft will start moving and this one start moving too so you can adjust it you need to adjust it to remove remove this one and also under this uh, gear under this gear have other head bolt so that is uh, that is required to adjust that one uh, actually Re, uh, not uh, required uh, remove the the camshafts 
because these springs it's very hard to uh, hard to do that without the tools you cannot remove you can I will show you 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 remove these springs but uh, you know with the special without the special tool you cannot install this so so but on this case on that engine that engine I just removed because we already have other head and we need to replace it, the camshaft too so so I did but when is uh, I start install back everything uh, you will see you will see how to do that so actually one more thing I show you all the bolts so here is so E12 Torx heads T60 a Torx 60 it's a big heads and T55 Torx 55 so that's it this kind of this kind of bolts you need to come off when you want to remove the head okay okay so this is how you do it uh, thank you so thank you so much guys for watching watching me don't forget subscribe and hit the like button and uh, put it on the not notification and follow me Facebook Instagram uh, uh, you can do that right now we take a little break and uh, as soon as possible coming other parts thank you peace